Welcome back to your Feel Good Breakfast Show Expresso on SABC3. Now, as you know, home improvement giant Builders, in association with Pro Sport International, is presenting South Africa's favourite sports quiz. Now, the second in the series of events took place at a packed out venue in Cape Town, and we were there to enjoy it. And they're now making their way to Johannesburg to test out your sporting knowledge against the wit of Quizmaster Dan Nickel while rubbing shoulders with some of the biggest names in South African sport. Now, a big plus point is that there'll also be fantastic prizes up for grabs courtesy of Bob. Now, the Johannesburg leg of the event takes place at Empress Palace on the 2nd of October. And in order to book your table, you've got to follow at ProSport INT or at Builders Fan on Twitter or like their Facebook page so you can be the first to hear on how you can book a table. So one more, once more, follow at ProSport INT and at, Pro, um, at Builders Fan on Twitter or like their uh, ProSport International uh, and, and Builders Warehouse Facebook page to, to find out how you can book uh, a seat there at the table of uh, this awesome sports quiz that we were able to. To attend. Now, if you've got an uh, old picture frame lying around that you don't know what to do with, maybe you want to upcycle it and make it into a nice frame that you can use to decorate. Our friends at Builders are showing us how in today's DIY. So this morning we are back with our DIY Builders expert, Mr. Andrew Donkin, for an easy DIY project. And I'm sure most of you have got an old picture frame at home but not too sure what to do with. Well, we've got a nice idea. Andrew, how are you doing, man? Very good, you and yourself. Cool, can't complain. So good what's good. the plan for this morning? Right, we're basically going to make a chalkboard picture frame. We've taken an old rubbish picture frame and we're going to spruce it up. We're going to paint the perimeter around it with uh, some spray paint. And then we're going to paint the glass with some chalkboard paint. Really easy, simple. You can hang it up, it's going to look cool and funky. Brilliant, let's get going. Yes, get cracking. So what we're going to do first, we're basically going to take these uh, picture frames and dismantle them. You want okay, to do that I'll one do as well? One. I'll do this little, little guy here. We can actually do two. All right. Okay, let's uh, let's start with our frames. We've put the glass over there. All right. Basically, we can take some steel wool or we can take some sandpaper. We're just going to rub it down just to get rid of any loose paint and just to clean up the frame. Give it a good rub down all the edges, take on the outer surface. Okay, so right, we're going to start um, start spraying now. Here's, uh, you're going to go for the green, I'll do the yellow. Okay, I'll do the green. There you go, there's one for you. Brilliant. Now, I love this stuff, paint in a can. Easy, easy <laughs> DIY. It makes life so much easier, it's quicker and it's less messy. I really enjoy it. I this. love it. Pretty straightforward, when you are spraying, start on the edge and bring it in across the, across the frame. Don't start on the other, you're going to get like a hot spot and it's basically going to be too much paint and it's going to start running. So bring it all the way through and out the other side. Okay. Okay, that looks good. I think yours might need a second coat. Let's put them underneath to dry. Okay. Uh, put them out of the way. Just lift up gently. Going to get a little bit of paint on your fingers, yeah, but right. that looks like we've been doing some work. <laughs> okay. Put that on there. Now we're basically going to do our glass. Simply give the can a good shake and spray the glass with blackboard paint. Remember to find complete instructions for this project as well as other great DIY ideas on Expresso's website. And one, two coats, what would be great? Give it at least one coat, two coats, just depending on how thick you actually do it. All right, Andrew, so these guys are nice and dry. I guess all that's left to do is assemble them. That's it, easy as that. Okay, so turn these guys around. Put glass in first. Right, there you have it. Done and dusted, looks really cool, really funky, especially with the different contrast of colours, hey? I love it. Andrew, thank you so much, man. Cool, no worries. Cool. And there we have yet another easy little DIY project. Now, guys, this really allows for you to be a little bit romantic. Why not, when you step out of the house in the morning, write a little note on there for your loved one saying something like, have a nice day, baby. I love you lots. P.S. The bar fridge is empty. Smiley face. <laughs> She'll love it. Yeah, I'm sure Mrs. Stratum is going to love that one. P.S. The bar fridge is empty, but lovely, easy DIY for you to try at home. And uh, of course, you can catch all of those ideas and the details on our website, expressoshow.com. Now, here's a cool thing. We're giving you a chance to win a 250 rands builder's voucher to expand on your DIY uh, creativity, if you will. All you have to do is SMS the keyword builders, including your name and city, to 33728. Now, this morning, we spoke about a lovely young girl. Her name, she's 17-year-old Lejean Marais, who's representing South Africa right now at an international competition in figure skating in Germany with the hopes of qualifying for the Winter Olympics soon in Russia. Let's take a look at her story.